Ryan, my man. Yes, sir. Ryan, this is Michael. Michael, this is Ryan. Michael, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Michael here okay. has got a project, a project that I'm not really sure that I even understand. This is a surprise for my wife. The trike is hers. Okay. It's a bluish, dark bluish trike, and it has always set to her Starry Night from Vincent Van Gogh. What I'm really interested to see is how in the world you're going to do something like this, right? I'm down. I'm down for the challenge. I know this isn't an easy project by any stretch, but I wouldn't just hand this off to anybody. Though I have no idea how Ryan's going to do this or exactly what he's going to do, I can't wait to see how it turns out. When Michael came to us and said he wanted us to replicate a Van Gogh masterpiece on the strike, I gotta admit, I was a little bit worried. But Ryan, he attacked this job with gusto. He spent hours perfecting the paint application so that it got the right look without overtaking the bike. Now Michael's here to present his wife with an amazing Count's Customs original. Why in the world the Starry Night? It just, it just pulls me, the movement, being on a bike, wind in your yeah. hair, you know, feeling things that yeah. in the air, just being alive in the middle of it. It is so unique, yet so beautiful. I love it, I love it. All right, here we go. Shannon, come on brother, bring that beautiful trike, baby. I know that sound. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh, even the beginning. <laughs> It is spectacular. To be asked to recreate a masterpiece like Vincent Van Gogh's Starry Night is a tall order. But to be asked to do it on a 2013 Harley Davidson, well, that's the kind of artistry my man Ryan is known for. To replicate the piled on paint look Van Gogh was known for, Ryan used a painstaking process of applying pinstriping paint in a canvas painter style and then sanded and buffed it flat. Over 150 hours went into making this piece of bike art looking so good that it's hard to tell the difference between it and the original. Man, I could get lost just staring at her. This is gonna be one of those paint jobs that everybody's gonna have to touch it because right. it looks right. like right. it's textured, yet it is as smooth as glass. And I love it, it's just, it's... It's genius and brilliant, and yeah. it's really great. I tried to wow. express the painting without overexpressing the painting. Right. It still has to look like a Harley Davidson trike and all the graphics have to work together. It looks like I drove through the painting. Yep. Yeah. You well, know? And the key parts just got attached to it and now they're with me all the time. This trike was not an easy thing to accomplish and I'm really proud of Ryan for pulling this off. You know, it's not every day that you're asked to put a famous piece of artwork on a bike like this, let alone something so abstract. And I gotta say, my guy Ryan killed it. I know Mike and Julie love it, and I'm betting that Vincent, he'd love it too.